How's it going, YouTube? Crossfair. Back with another episode of our Pokemon Rising Ruby Nuzlocke. And I think we're I think we're good to go. Do a quick team recap. Uh, I got like 30 minutes before I go play Magic the Gathering, so I figured I'd slot in a quick little episode here. We got Pinche, our Krabby with the Miracle Sea with Crab Hammer knockoff cut and Hunk Gloves. We got Moon, our Teddy Ursa with Slash Knight Slash Bulk Up and Cut. We got Katie, our Pidgeotto with Wing Attack, Steel Wing, Quick Attack, and Feather Dance. We got Ginger, our Marowak with Rock Tomb, Boomerang, Double Kick, and Focus Energy. We got Lola, our Light Bird with Thief Cut, T-Wave, and Hone Gloss. And we got Kippers, our little Mud Kip, Marsh Tomp, Marsh Tomp with Water Balls, Rock Tomb, Mud Bomb, and Yawn. We're probably not going to use Kippers or Lola too much here. Um, I want to make sure I try to keep everyone around the same level. Vroom vroom. Uh, I think we get one, two, three, four, four encounters. Is it four or five? I'm gonna actually hop off of this. Do we want to battle people? Do we want to do the like family battle? Nah. You even battle us? What do you do? Oh yeah, he talks about getting owned by the family. Uh, shoot. You have to teach TMs in this game, don't you? Oh wait, do we have Rock Smash? Oh, we do. Okay. Uh, who benefits from this the most? Probably Ginger. Was Rock Smash always 65 power? I mean, it's pretty much, it's better than double kick, ain't it? I guess if it's super effective, double kick is more. Please no Pokemon, please no Pokemon, please no Pokemon, please no Pokemon. <laughs> no, <laughs> come on. Seriously? What are the odds of that? This sucks our encounter with a Geodude. Well, my hair is all messy today. I got that bed head. <laughs> I wonder what mons we missed out on here. Fucking Geodude. Uh, Jiru is not bad though. I, I think we can evolve him in this. Hopefully we can evolve the boulder. Because Golem's not terrible. Ah, uh, this was Route 111. Yo, dude. Boulder. Bada boom. Okay, we don't want to do a double battle. Uh, let's actually fight a couple people though as we go. I think the, uh... We're just gonna kind of go up to the town by Meteor Falls. Maybe we'll go, depending on time constraints here... We'll go in Meteor Falls and get the encounter at least, and then just kind of gauge our team from there. Because, uh, uh, I know we have to fight the guy in Meteor Cave, and then we go to the top of the mountain thing, but I think in the base game, they're only like 24, so we're already, like, scaled way above where you normally are. So we might have to do a little trading. We'll try to see what the level they are. All I know is this crab hammer Kingler is gonna absolutely wreck. What level does Krabby evolve? Is it 34? Kingler! Oh, it's 28! Oh my god, he's one level away! Oh! Uh, I can't get rid of Cut, can I? 
Yeah. I think knock is just better. Yeah. Let's keep knock. Knock is just so good for uh, gym leaders. Trainers where we know they have items. Like this thing right here. Just get the fuck out of my face. Oh, boy. <laughs> Okay, let's definitely get Pinch A to 28. ASAP. Is there even grass on this route? We have this route. We have the cave. We have the route up top with the ash on it. We have the route to the left and we have the moon. So we do have five encounters. Oh, let's just home claws. So our crab hammer can't miss now. It's a good thing about honey claws. Diglity. Yeah, I'm gonna minimize stuff as I go. Is this is really weird being at the house sitting? Cause usually I have uh I have my monitor. I bring my two monitors, but usually I have a big uh, TV. That's kind of like my pseudo third monitor that I put like uh, stuff on. Like say I'd have like Bulbapedia open. So if you've ever watched one of my episodes and I'm looking like that, that's when I'm looking up at like uh, levels, moves, stuff like that. But we don't have that here. Usually I have my, uh, my, like, recording on the TV, too, so I just glance up to make sure it's not, like, frozen or that it's still recording and stuff, so. Now I have to have it, like, half the screen, half the screen for that stuff, <laughs> it just feels weird. I'm out of my element. I still don't know what game I'm going to play after this. I think for my... I was going to play like a retro game after this. Like I was going to play uh, Pokemon Coliseum. But I might just do that as like our fourth game. Like retro game. I don't know yet. Obviously... Oh, am I locked into Fire Spin? Or does Fire Spin go away? It goes away when he dies. Okay. What are it? That doesn't particularly make sense to me. That fire spin, whirlpool, and stuff goes away when the mon dies or switches out. I feel like if you're trapped, it shouldn't matter if the mon's in or not. It's not like rap. I guess it has the same like coding as rap, maybe. And they just never bothered to change it. <laughs> I feel like that'd be, uh, oh, fuck yeah. I feel like that'd be really sweet, though, to be able to, like, in competitive, fire spin something and, like, switch out and it's trapped for a couple turns. I mean, obviously that makes gimmicky stuff a little easier to do. But, I mean, fire spin's unplayable right now and... Anything, even casual fire spin whirlpool sucks. Oh, you learn hammer arm. Damn, I still think knockoff is better. Let's just think. So steel types we can hit with crab hammer. Rock types we can hit with crab hammer. Dark types we can technically just hit with Crab Hammer. What does fighting actually net us? I don't think it really does anything. 
We can always reteach it later. We just gotta check Kingler's, uh... Does he keep the shell armor? Okay. So our boy can't be crit. We got 94 attacks, 73 defense. Holy crap. Man is thick. Is anyone even close? Oh, Marowak's thick too. Holy crap, dude. We don't... We don't have a very good Spadefmon. I guess Swampert will be our Spadefy one. Let's try to get Moon up. He don't battle me right here, does he? Oh wait, this is a different route. This is Route 112. Oh, we get another encounter. Oh, there was no grass right there. Is all that strip 111? Dude, can you piss off and leave me alone? I'm gonna move your head into the ground if you don't get out of my way. <laughs> What's this strip right here? I... This is 111. Oh, so this whole strip is 111. Okay. So I went the ran into the grass till uh, after the little fireplace right here. Uh, do we want Ursa up front? Probably not. Let's put Kippers up front. He has Yawn. Alright, 112. A Scyther. <laughs> well. Looks like Scizor's back on the menu, boys. <laughs> this is going to be like the 12th one we've killed. <laughs> I guess I could have just quick balled him. We still can, can't we? I think quick ball goes down a little bit on turn two, but it's still viable. Okay, now it's not viable. We're dead. I didn't see, was there like a metal coat at the Slateport place? Where they were selling all the stones and stuff? I think Satchet was in there. I don't know if Metal Claw was. I don't know if we can actually evolve him. I don't know if there's like a link cable to evolve Golem either. Muddy Water. Doesn't this have shit accuracy? Uh. It's actually a hard choice. I'm gonna keep that. He's gonna have like surf when we get or waterfall. I just feel like missing is gonna completely screw him over. But not killing something can also be just as bad, right? Slice and dice. Okay. Oh, Intimidate might have actually been nice. Couldn't get away. Use Pursuit. Toros equal Pursuit. Got it. Okay, give me a super good fire Pokemon in here. I think they're, in the base game there's like wheezing and stuff. Or coughing. But like Torkoal is kind of what I want. <laughs> Perfect! Damn! Call your fucking shots, I guess. 
Torkoal is one of the OG homies. We almost have like a nasty trick room team, actually. Too bad uh, we lost Reuniclus. Because we could have like trick room, Torkoal, Kingler. Bum, 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 bum. I guess we can yawn. Probably gonna miss. Or not. I wish I had like false swipe on something. Yeah, I'm just looking at our like dock for our mons. We still we like our box is all water Pokemon besides the ones we just caught. <laughs> we ain't got shit. I mean the Geodude Scyther Torkoal are three pretty decent mons. Like, having one of our encounters be Smeargle fucking sucked. Like, that's a complete scratch waste of a route. It's Tordy. We did need a fire Pokemon really bad, though, so I'm glad we didn't get the... Uh... Like wheezing or something. Or coughing. I think we can battle this guy. Let's not skip too many trainers. I don't want to do too much like off screen fucking grinding. Nice crit. I wonder if we could have got Grimer in that cave in Fiery Path. I don't know. I feel like Torkoal was the best Mon out of that cave. Obviously, that's. I don't know what else is in there. They could have added stuff like they added, uh. Other things. This thing have poison point. It's got poison jab. Oh shit. We're playing a dangerous game. Okay. Uh, I think we just quick attack. Make your attack quick and true. Ah. Uh... Let's get rid of quick attack, because I'm not sure if her special or physical is higher. I think when it becomes a Pidgeot, its special will be higher. I think right now her physical is higher, but I don't think that's going to remain the same. Yeah, her physical is way higher. Uh, let's go Ginger. Ginger's got that big bulky defense. She take like nothing from this thing. Yeah. Good job, Gingy. We always believed in you, bud.
What's the middle one? That looks like a like Nana berry person. Okay. I have no idea what any of these berries do off the top of my head, but we're grabbing all of them. Uh, we can put Moon up front. We have to like switch him out. The only problem with Teddy Ursa is he's pretty uh pretty frail. I think there's a house we can heal in right here though. Oh god. So I don't think I stand. <laughs> that pursuit did a lot. <sighs> and so it begins. I ain't switching out, bro. What? He thought he was going to catch me lacking and get me switching out. Come on. Marsh Tomp, please. Oh, he missed a jump kick. Oh, and then I missed another mud bomb. This is why I didn't teach muddy water. Okay. <laughs> Playing with fire here. We know Quagshire doesn't have no pursuit. We do have a nice, beautiful Miracle Seed cut Kingler here. A Scyther! I'm gonna be genuinely surprised if Crab Hammer doesn't just murder this thing. Oh, that's, that actually took that pretty well. Is he, uh, is he Eviolite? <laughs> Dang, bro. Scyther bulky. Is this where he's going to teach me about the secret base? I can't skip this guy either, can I? Oh my god. At least this game only has a couple instances of like this. Like, we're playing black and white right now on the Nuzlocke. And holy shit, the amount of talking in that game is unreal. Every single route, every single gym, every single moment, that one of the people are interrupting you, like making you talk to them and show them stuff and deal with Team Plasma and I need help and oh, let's battle. Like, damn, dude, I want to play the game. Yeah, sure, creepy old dude. Let's just go in this tree fort with you. <laughs> Stranger danger, bro. Come on. Yay. <sighs> wow, this looks stupendous. We will definitely be back to upgrade and change our secret base to make it look way cooler. Because this is just an awesome feature. We'll definitely do this. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I'll be right back, dude. Definitely going to spiff up my base, make it look super nice. Uh, we'll probably spend like hours in here, to be honest. Checking out the base, checking out all the cool items we can put in there. Yeah, it's going to be dope. Is it you that heals me? Yeah. I can't remember if this was this house or if it was the house by uh, Winona, like right 
to the right of us. But that's the the watchtower. Is it called the watchtower? What's it called? Weather Institute. Don't do anything funny, dude. Uh. <laughs> Actively trying to fucking avoid everybody like the black. <laughs> Maybe we. Ah, I want to get the mountain encounter. I just gotta watch the time to not be late. Oh, he heals me. Bro, I just healed. <laughs> Brandon, piss off, dude. I got an encounter to get. This is a new route, right? Yeah, well, 113. 113 is a... Munchlax. Okay. Could be worse. Sweet. There's nothing more annoying than them breaking out of the ball. Uh, you know what? We'll name you Matt. <laughs> For the boys. I think Matt likes Snorlax. I know it's Heracross, but we probably won't find Heracross. You don't turn, do you? Fuck you. There's not a lot of mons I can name Matt after that we'll find. What? Houndoom, Typhlosion, Heracross, Snorlax. Um, so, Slash? I'm scared of this thing having, uh, oh wait, it, this might just have Arena Trap. We might not even be able to switch out. So fuck it. Fuck him up, Teddy Ursa. Yeah! <laughs> Slash is going to be your best move for 90% of this game, so let's go. Or warned against Slash. Uh, I have Night Slash, sir. Yeah. Good play. Good play. A Fero Seed. Uh. Huh, we really don't have a good mod for this, do we? I guess, Katie? I would just go Marowak and click, uh... Click of that move, but... I don't know if this thing has a Garesta. Like, he might have, like, Bullet Seed. Get flinched. Get flinched. <laughs> What am I, Togekiss? <laughs> yeah! Oh, he did have Bullet Seed. Okay, cool. See? That's why you don't switch in? We- I think we definitely need to drop someone, which unfortunately might be Ginger. And I think we have to pick up Torkoal. Maybe after Flannery we'll do that. We'll keep Marowak for, like, Flannery. But... Like, we need Torkoal for grass types and stuff, because that's going to become an issue pretty quick. We have Pidgeot, but... Pidgeot's kind of trash. Uh... Do I care about any of these items? 
Oh, Skarmory would have been sweet. Well, this is where you die, buddy. Do we have a repel? Probably not. We have two. Oh, we have super repels too. <laughs> I forgot about this. <laughs> I forgot about the little douchebag set in the fucking ground. Ugh. Uh, I kind of want to bulk up, but we'll see how much this does. Yeah. I'm going to have to slash again, because... Dang, I was hoping for a crit. If I bulk up and he poisons me, we would have been in big trouble. Kind of goofing around with self-destruct, too. What that say? Shelmet? God, what type is this thing? This is a Selgor. Is this Steel Bug? I don't know if he's Steel Bug. It doesn't appear like he is Steel Bog. Is this Selgor Steel Bog? Shelmet's Pure Bog. Oh no, S Cavalier is the other one. S Cavalier is the one I was thinking of. Oh, this might have a rollout. Iron defense, okay. You do that, buddy boy. Little Sentai pad. <laughs> we'll see you, buddy. Oh, we barely dodged her. Not a very good DM, but okay. Let's play the avoid people mini game. Let's go run in here. We got time. I want to get the fucking, uh, not Mount Moon, Mount Cornette, is that what it's called? I want to at least get that encounter, see our team, and then we'll get people, like, leveled up before we go into the mountain. Because there's going to be a fight in the mountain, and then we're going to go straight up to the Mount Cornette. Oh my god, are you really going to bug me with this bullcrap? Ultra balls are only 300 blocks. Take 10 of those. Dawn stone, dust stone, shiny stone. Interesting. We need a way to evolve. I need to know if the link cables in here and metal claw or metal coat.
I don't think there's a way to get a mon in Fall Arbor Town, is there? There's no, like, water or anything right here. Should we fish for our encounter? <laughs> you give us roar, right? Yeah. Garbage. Okay, what do we want out of this grass? Anything that's not Swablu! <laughs> Come on! Stupid, stupid, stupid. Why did I say anything? <laughs> so dumb. Oh, you're not learning takedown. Yes. I just remembered this thing was in the grass in like the base game. If you don't turn, we'll just battle you. Get our last encounter and then... Evaluate our team, I guess. Hey, Deary. Cat hates my fucking guts. I mean, we're close to having Ursa Ring, though. Uh... What's this place called coming up? Meteor Falls, that's what it's called. Spoke up. Dang, he missed twice. And wow, we missed three slams in a row. Come on, sheep. You gotta do better than that, buddy. Um, I mean, we bulked up. Can't hear us that they get out of Drudagon. What a homie. Oh, you have another mod? You have a dino. Nice. I was gonna say that thing could have just Dragon Rage. Stop right there! Oh! I don't want to battle anyone else. There's an item in one of these, though. Oh, there's one in both. Is there one in this one, too? No. Dang, should I move my secret base to right there? Hmm. Maybe I should. Maybe moving the secret base is the play. Fucking douche. Arr! 
I don't really have a good move to hit, uh... Oh wait, I have caught, don't I? Oh. Jesus. Um, I guess we can go pinchy. Yeah, Crab Hammer is a little different than a uh, cut. Moon hit 30, I think he gets... Ursa Ring now. Let's just knock, make sure he dies. Yeah! Yes, sir. I could have basically could have cut this into uh, two episodes because we're on like 40 minutes right now. But you know what? <laughs> we got a stopping point that I'm not stopping until we get there. We're getting that fucking encounter in the mountain. Crunch. Uh, sure. And then it looks like I'm going to get everyone to 33 for the Mount Chimney, Mountain, all that bullcrap. Do we have to do another battle? Oh no, we get to skip you. Cool. Perfect. And finally, our Meteor Falls is Drudagon. Uh, okay. I was expecting like uh, Gobat, Zubat, something dumb like that. And Drudo dude used glare. Pinche become paralyzed. He may be unable to move. Corrosive threw an ultra ball. Clink. Bing. <laughs> oh no, it broke free. He has Thunder Fang. Quickly switch Pokemon. Cause holy god. <laughs> Thank fuck he missed. <laughs> Yo. I wonder if I should yawn him. Man, you aren't even a good, like, dragon. Stop. Oh, you have Fire Fang, too. So Fire Fang, Thunder Fang, Glare. I realistically think I can Water Pulse one time, but I don't want to Water Pulse, confuse him, and have him, like, take more damage than I'm suspecting, and then he, like, kills himself with the confusion. Because I don't know how much Water Pulse will do. I assume it's going to do, like, nothing. Bro, come on. Don't do this stupid shit. <gasps> stay in the ball, stay in the ball. Fire fang. Num num.
Oh, his other move is Slash. Yeah, you just crit every hit, huh? Fucker. Yeah. Okay, that ain't doing shit. I guess we could have bone meringued. That probably went to guild. There, now he's sleeping. He's weak. <laughs> we weakened him. We did all the things you're supposed to do to catch Pokemon. Now reward me, please. Thank you. Easy. Easy clap. Everybody clap. I wonder if we want Gyarados. I forgot, we have a Moxie Gyarados in our box still. Honestly, we probably use Talon here. If my mouse works? Question mark? Alright. Okay, so to our left is a battle. We're gonna leave here. I'm gonna run back to the center. I'm gonna evaluate our team. We're gonna get everyone to... What level is Kippers? T31? 32 or 33? I don't know. I'll have to figure out what level the, like, Mount Chimney fight is with Maxi. And make sure we don't, like, over-level that. But we'll, we'll, we'll figure it out. Uh, might do some team changes. We do have a lot of mods now. I don't know if I'm going to grab Torkoal yet, but I don't know. We'll see. We'll see what happens. Uh, that is going to do it for this episode, though, guys. If you're enjoying the Pokemon Rising Ruby Nuzlocke, you know, make sure you do all the YouTube things. As always, hit that sub button if you're not already subbed. We do have two videos every single day, and I'll see you guys next time.